Hey guys. So, the stake two. Um, I want to first start out with apologizing for how poor quality my video was that did go up yesterday. That was just a small explanation. Um, and I should have listened to my gut when on Wednesday when I was like, I should record this video today and then just have it time to post tomorrow. So I should have done that. Um, I'll explain a couple things in the end of this video about maybe this weekend and possibly my schedule being super out of wonk at one point. Um, but those will be talked at the end of the video. So my intro is not that long. Um, so I am doing stitches. So the cover did say I didn't decide to change it last minute. I almost did, but I was like, no, I said stitches. I'm stick with stitches. Um, this is take two because it said red and I said bread. So I also said one word really, really weird. So I was like, okay, hold up that. No, I was going to roll with it. And then I messed up again. I was like, okay, no, and we're going to fix both those mistakes. Um, but yeah, so we'll talk, I'll talk more about my schedule and possibly what's going to happen this weekend at the end of the video. So stay tuned for that. Did you want to record it? I thought that I've been hurt before But no one's ever left me quite this sore Your words cut deeper than a knife Now I need someone to breathe me back to life Got a feeling that I'm going under but I know that I'll make it out of life If I quit calling you my lover And move on You watch me bleed until I can't breathe I'm shaking, falling onto my knees And now that I'm without your kisses I be needing stitches Tripping over myself I'm aching, begging you to come home and now that I'm without your kisses, I be needing stitches, just like a moth drawn to a flame. Oh, you lured me in and I couldn't sense the pain. Your bitter heart cold to the touch. Now I'm gonna reap what I sow. I'm left seeing red on my own Got a feeling that I'm going under But I know that I'll make it out alive If I quit calling you my lover And move on You watch me bleed until I can't breathe I'm shaking, falling onto my knees And now that I'm without your kisses I be needing stitches Tripping over myself, I'm aching, begging you to come help. And now that I'm without your kisses, I be needing stitches. Needle in the thread, gotta get you out of my head Needle in the thread, gonna wind up dead Needle in the thread, gotta get you out of my head Needle in the thread, gonna wind up dead Needle in the thread, gotta get you out of my head Needle in the thread, gonna wind up dead Needle in the thread, gotta get you out of my head Get you out of my head You watch me bleed until I can't breathe I'm shaking, falling onto my and now that I'm without your kisses, I be needing stitches, tripping over myself, I'm making, begging you to come help, and now that I'm without your kisses, I be needing stitches. I be needing stitches. I be needing stitches. Okay, that went so much better. Thank you for not going into the next video. I forgot I was on a playlist. 
Um, so yeah, that went twice as better than the first one. That's awesome. Um, and you can definitely tell from watching my very first video up till now, my confidence level has just built up. And that is because of you all. That's because of my subscribers. That's because of my friends. That's because of my choir teacher. Um, hilarious story about choir. My freshman year, there was one talk going around beginning of the year. This is way before the fight broke out, towards the end. At the beginning of the year, we were in, he put us in small groups of people we roughly sit near. And that was to where we could kind of figure out how we sound, to where he, like, see if we could self-blend ourselves. So the group I was put with, I do not remember what song we were singing. It might have been Jar of Hearts. I'm not terribly sure. I made the mistake. Now, before this whole virus and all that, his classes used to be between 60 and 75 students. They are now, like, under 20. There's barely 20 in women's choir, I've heard from a women's choir member. I don't know about advanced choir, and I don't know about intro, and I don't know about concert yet, either. But my freshman year... There was about 30, maybe 40 students at Freshman Choir in his intro choir. And I just remember it was our group's turn to go. And I made the terrible mistake at looking at everyone who was in the group or in the class. I ran out in panic attack. I ran out crying and hyperventilating. My One of my best friends, she's still one of my best friends today. I look at her more as a sister now than I do a friend. Um, she's also one of a few girls who I will actually wake up in, like, the dead of not just to talk to if she needs me. Well, she knows all she has to do is call me, and her number will pop up, and I'm like, okay, and I'll talk to her. But she runs out behind me, helps calm me down. I go back in, barely was able to sing. Our group redid it the next day. I still was slightly panicking, but I didn't run out of the classroom that day. Fast forward a week later. He's letting kids get up and sing in front of the class. Just a little short thing. He was waiting on someone to go. No one in the auto section had gone that day. So I was like, you know what? I'm gonna do it. Now keep in mind, just a week before that, I had a, a panic attack in his class because of the same thing. But I was singing with a group. The kid sees me gets up. Starts cheering. Love this girl to death. I, surprisingly, her name is Love. Um, she sees me get up, starts cheering. My good friend Brittany sees me gets up, does the same thing. So at that point, I'm standing in front of the class, wanting to back out. But I was like, no, I'm not going to back out. I wanted to say I did Amazing Grace. I'm not terribly sure. And I just remember popping and looking at certain students. It was Love, Brittany, there was a few other Sopranos, my friend Delilah, which is... I, Pause on the story. Do, never request Hey There Delilah. That is one song I just refuse to sing. She hates that song because so many people would pick on her over it, I feel like. So that is one song. If you ever request it, I it, just no. That will never be a song I recover in respect of my friend. Um, I would look at Mr. Moore and I'd look at a couple other students that I trusted. And I was able to sing part of Amazing Grace, about 20 ish seconds of it. And. Right before I went to sit down, he was like, I want to hug you. He's like, to think just a week ago, you had a panic attack singing with a group. And then you were able to get up by yourself. So that took over the panic attack story. That the same girl who had the panic attack got up by herself and sang. So through choir, through my subscribers, my best friends, I've been able to get more and more out of my comfort zone. Because like you can tell from my first video up till now, I have changed so much. Yes, I physically have changed. And I have mentally have changed. Um, so that's amazing. Now, talking about my schedule. There may be a chance in the upcoming weeks that I may have to pause. Or at some point, I'm going to have to count when my mom figures out what's going on. And gets me, gets me dates set up. Um... There's going to be about eight weeks where I probably won't record any. Um, if I do, they'll be very low quality and they'll probably be semi-dark because I'll be upstairs in one of my rooms. Um, so that may happen. I'm not terribly sure, so that may, ha may, that may change. But once you can do that, they may go from two videos a week to one video a week and that being on Wednesday. Every week. Um, 
that just depends on how many covers I can get out and that depends on again my timing um and then this weekend my niece should be coming over and we've got one I've got one video plan if she wants to do it that's this is if she comes over if she doesn't then I'll we'll do them the next time she comes over um, if she's up to it because right now it's still pretty warm outside so one of my video plans that a couple of them that'll be outside that should still work I hope just hoping my phone doesn't overheat because again that's why I record off of I still can't find my GoPro um one part again one person knows the video plan the first one that'll go up um she doesn't know the rest because I haven't figured out the rest I'm a brainstorm with my niece when she gets here um I think so my next cover should be Tuesday um I may have to sit down Saturday and record two videos um for those days and have them upload at different times have have one upload that Tuesday have one upload that Thursday um so I've got enough to do that I've also made the cover playlist public i'm not sure if you can add to it yet um i guess we'll have to play that by ear and if you can't again just keep commenting covers you want me to see done as i done said uh speechless by dan and shay will be done at some point in the near future it's just going to take me quite a while uh quite a while to learn the song um and that's going that's for a special friend I'm not sure about my next cover. It's either going to be Attention or Drift Away. I'm not sure yet. I'm trying to think. Also, the first video with my niece that I upload, do not take it serious. It's just going to be both of us kind of goofing around with something. Um, but in that one, I will have the audio we're using in the background. It'll be in the description, and the top the top link will be where we got the idea from, which was from a set of YouTubers I watch. So, look forward to that. Do not, for the love of God, do not take that video serious. It's just, we just want to see, like, someone who did choir and someone who's semi-doing choir, how that works. Um, so, that'll be done... Probably tomorrow. We'll just spend that whole day doing different random crazy stuff. Um, but yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, leave a thumbs up. Again, I'm sorry about not uploading yesterday. I just was not home alone at all that day. Um, I was with my mom the entire day. That's we went and did stuff. Uh, if you are new here, subscribe. I'm also very close to 50 subscribers, and I know, hey, that's not a lot. But to someone who battle stage raw, there for the longest time never uploaded on a normal schedule. It was like I would upload one day and then it'd be months before I uploaded another. Um, and someone who, I mean, I'm a small, yes, I'm a small account, but nearly having 50 subscribers just blew me away when I saw that last night. I was working on settings and all that, and I saw that, and I was just like, I was like, holy crap, I am near 50 subscribers, and I got so happy. Um, so yeah. Um, I am going to leave, I'm going to change something on my main page, and that's like the subscribers that like you can see on the side, I'm adding a new one. Um, and you really ought to go check her out. She does amazing work. I'm really good friends with her. She probably knows who she is. Um, I've been texting her today. But y'all should really go check out her channel. She does some really good work. She writes her own music. And yeah, she just does amazing work in my opinion. Um, I will put her, on, like if you're on my main channel, she'll be on the side. And then I'll put her YouTube channel in the description. So y'all ought to... You really should check her out. Um, but anyways, hope you guys enjoyed. Um, if no one's told you, I love you. You are beautiful. You are handsome. You are good looking. Um, stay safe, which is something I've 
started doing or started saying when people have to leave. Um, but yeah, take care of yourself. The world needs you. I need you. I may not know who you are. I may not be close with you. But someone out there needs you. And if you say no one does, then I need you. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, you know what to do. Bye!